Hi guys! So this past weekend was my birthday. Um, it was February 17th was my birthday and that is why this video is going up late. I apologize guys. Um, I was out of town this weekend and then when I came home um, back to Savannah, oh I have two homes now but whatever, it's just like I have so much work to do and I'm still not done yet and I woke up at like 9 this morning and I never do that because I always sleep till like 11. So um, I just wanted to do this video so that it feels fresh and new and exciting and all that rather than just being like oh yeah I got this a month ago but I'm showing you now kind of deal um so this is pretty much just my birthday haul I'm not bragging or anything I'm just saying what I got for my birthday because I always like watching stuff like that and it's not like a crap ton or anything like that so don't be like oh my god she's getting this this and this which is I'm really happy what I got and everything. So um, pretty much I'm going to start with what my family got me and the reason that my parents didn't really get me anything is because uh, my dad is paying for me to go to this college so um, I didn't really complain there. But I will show you what my sister got me and um, she is obsessed with Victoria's Secret which is a good and a bad thing. It's good because she spends some of it on me but bad because she has like 20 bikinis. Like who needs who needs 20 bikinis okay so she got me this purple zip up jacket and it says love or love pink yeah it says love pink on the sleeve and I love purple and I think this is so cute the thing is is that like it feels like it was washed or like it's like more towel material on the inside it's not like super uber fuzzy and it's not as thick either because this is like a summer or, or spring like jacket. I mean it could be used for summer too, but it's not supposed to be that heavy because it's not really winter anymore. Um, when I did go home though, it snowed and then I came back here uh, to Savannah and it's like an hour away from Florida. So uh, talk about a weather change. That was insane, but I was really happy I got to see snow. And then she also got me these matching pants. And these are more of the Capri scrunchy bottom pants and they also say love pink on the side. I haven't worn these yet um, just because when I wear sweatpants most of the time it's long pants around the room and stuff like that. Sometimes I'll wear them to class but these are some scrunched up ones and there's a little pocket on the back too which I thought was cute. I really like this purple color so I was really happy she got me that because she always gives me like Victoria's Secret loungewear stuff. It's awesome. So then we're going to get into the Sephora stuff over here. So here is my Sephora bag and this was all to myself. Um, I got a lot but I didn't spend as much money as I normally would for this stuff and I'll show you why. So um, this first one I actually did not get this month. I got last month. This is the Tarte Clean Slate Poreless uh, 12 hour perfecting primer and I've been using this a while so there will be a, will be a review for this Ooh, Okay, and it's just nice to have a really nice primer like this. Um, there will be a review eventually for this um, I'm just still getting used to it and all that stuff and what works best with it and what doesn't and all that good stuff with that Okay, so I'll start off what I actually spent most of my money on and um, they had this kit for makeup forever and what it is is that you actually get a whole bunch of products all in one kit for a lower price than you normally would so what I ended up getting was this HD complexion starter kit right here so it comes with the foundation and it comes with your primer and your powder and your brush that you can use for foundation and for powder. I also have the box here that the um, foundation came in. Um, it doesn't normally come with the bottle in there, you pick out the box. And so the shade I'm in is N127 and he picked it so that like it's gonna, when I get darker, I get dark pretty quick, but when I'm darker it will show up a little more. And it looks so good with my skin tone. Any foundation I get is like orange and this stuff isn't. I think this is a neutral tone or it's a yellow undertone. Um, if you guys know what the N means in the N127, let me know. I think it's just neutral if I'm not mistaken. I mean, it would make sense. If it was like a warm undertone, maybe it would have like a W or something like that. I, I really don't know. So um, the stuff that's in here is a pretty good size. This is the HD primer. Um... It depends how well this spreads for it to last that long because the Tarte one you kind of have to use a lot 
and with my hard candy primer you don't have to use a lot at all you just use a little bit so we're gonna see how well this like spreads across your face I don't know I have not used this yet next is the uh, powder and then the little kabuki brush it's kabuki brush it's just it's so soft it's ridiculous how soft this is oh my god um <laughs> the thing with the powder is that it has the little stiff stiff thingy oh sifter oh my god stiff what um and the thing is this is not travel friendly at all because i opened a few of these when i was um traveling back home and driving and stuff and just like all the powder comes out like you can't flip it over and keep it over and shake it and whatever so it's really like not travel friendly at all um but it's so it's like amazing how just like micro this stuff is um i used it a little bit today but i don't think i used it right probably didn't so this next little box right here this is my 500 points perk and this is the bare minerals hall of fame uh top rated favorite for face and i've never had anything by bare minerals if i if i'm saying that correctly i don't think i've had anything bare minerals so it comes with a blush um which is in oh you don't give me the color i don't i okay i don't know what the color is um i think it's like called just blush or blushed or something like that or I, I don't know and then it also comes with a small mineral veil finishing powder which i think is just only for under eye circle if i'm not mistaken i could be wrong and then and also a well rested concealer thing and i was so happy about this because emily noel talks about the powder but this is the concealer so we'll see how that works it's like a click tube and then here is the uh bare minerals prime time primer for foundation okay so the blush is just called beauty but i'm gonna try to show you how messy this is it's just like not okay can you guys see that just like ooh, it is everywhere all up in there it is like not in the sifter at all so i wish it was more travel friendly especially because it's a loose pigment I don't think loose pigments in general are supposed to be like that. The mineral veil stuff. I put it under my eye today. Oh my god. It's like micro. And you know how like your your eye concealer will crease if you put too much on or something like that? Well, I don't think it's creased yet. Could be wrong, but I don't think it creased yet. And then here's just the well-rested concealer uh, clicky thing. I like the clicky thing, but then again, I don't. I don't know I prefer just to have like something to dip it into and then this foundation primer look how small this is I could use this like two uses maybe like this is so small but I don't know we'll see how it works and then since it was my birthday the last thing I did get was the birthday gift oh my god so the last thing I did get was my birthday gift for being a Beauty Inside member which is like the best thing about Sephora um so pretty much you just get a uh, whatever the gift is that year uh so this year it is the real birthday turn-ons okay um <laughs> and it has the their real mascara and the what's up highlighter now these are really tiny but i still have well actually okay that is a lie um last year i actually got the sugar lip stuff and i used the hell out of that um, it is $22 for that chapstick though, but it's amazing. Um, but that's all gone, but like stuff like makeup samples like this, this lasts me so long. So I really like the What's Up highlighter. I've used it twice already. It's really good. And then the Their Real Mascara. The only thing I don't like about this is that when you use the little spiky ball at the end, it gets really clumpy, but it gets all your lashes. So that's good and bad. So... I don't know, but it's nice to get like stuff like this for free because most of the time Benefit sells like packs like this for like $10 and you just got this for free. It's so cool. So the only thing that I got left was just a gift card to Target from my grandmother. It was $50. Um, I'm happy with what I got. I really am. Um, also, I have not checked my mailbox yet. I'm supposed to have a check there and a gift card and whatever else is in there. Um, I just have not checked my mailbox yet, so I probably should do that. Um, but I am so grateful and so many people wish me happy birthday and I don't wish people happy birthday on Facebook. I know that's weird. I just, unless I like really care about you, I'll send you like an actual test, text or a really nice message on Facebook or whatever. But like, I don't write happy birthday on people's wall. I got like 50 comments, but 
I mean, like, people might get, like, 200 if they have a thousand friends, and I'm like, that's just not me. And I was just, like, so happy that, like, people I haven't talked to in years said, like, happy birthday to me, and, like, family that's in, like, you know, California and stuff and whatever, and I'm just like, oh my god. It makes me so happy, especially because I was home this weekend. I am so homesick. It's not like I'm crying myself to sleep or anything, but I want to be home. I want to be home for spring break so bad. I miss my boyfriend. I miss my dog. I miss my family. It's just, can I want to be home, please? I still have 23 more days till I have spring break, which isn't too bad. But, um, and then I uh, soon enough I'll be on spring break or summer summer break so um my desk is all messy now i have a lot of work to do and it is 10 17. thank you guys so much for watching um i hope you guys have a fantastic day make sure to get your sephora beauty gift when is your birthday because it's the best thing about sephora it is completely free and um yeah you can rack up points too that's how i got the 500 dollars perks and all that good stuff um i don't know if i mentioned the price of the makeup forever kit it was um 80 and then, oh, oh my god, oh my god, I totally forgot. Okay, so, wow, oh my god, I was so excited about this part, I almost totally forgot. Um, when I went with my boyfriend, my sweet, sweet boyfriend came with me. Weird, I know. But, um, I told him that they have guy stuff here too, so he went to go look at the guy fragrances, and he's like, oh yeah, I really like this, I really like this. I'm like, oh, okay, well, did you know they have, like, shaving cream and, like, you know, guy beard stuff, whatever. And he's like, cool, blah, blah, blah. And so the makeup artist who was working on me... I uh, went to go show him, and he got, like, free samples, like, out the roof. Like, it was crazy. He got, like, this Anthony aftershave stuff or shaving cream that had, like, marshmallow in it. And he got two of the little containers that, like, were full. And then he got the guy birthday gifts also. Even though he's not a beauty insider and it's not his birthday, um, he got the Jack Black shaving cream stuff and then he got the Anthony facial cleanser and they were like really good sized bottles like I'm just like oh my god like <laughs> it's a good thing you came with me because you just got some freebies out of that and all that good stuff so um okay that's what I wanted to do because oh my gosh this guy who worked on my face I think his name is Joel who works at Sephora he is awesome oh my god I've seen him there like ever like all the time ever since I've been going to Sephora I always see him there and he's so professional and he's so nice and I'm just like oh my god um so yeah okay people at Sephora can be awesome sometimes like really awesome okay I really have to go because I have a shit ton of work to do thank you guys for watching I'm so happy so blessed that I got to go home this weekend and now I'm paying for it because I didn't do any work this weekend so that's why I have to go okay Mwah. thank you guys for watching I will see you guys in a later video and I'm 20 that's so weird I won't try that again